Wow, well, ladies and gentlemen, we are we're here at Black Point. Um, my name is Alfred Montner, guys, and I am on. Oh my God, I'm gonna get rained on like there's no tomorrow. Uh, it's nice to see my friends and my ten female subscribers that we have a brand new, fresh out the box flag. Uh, that was put up yesterday on uh, July 4th, so it, uh, She's waving nice and All right, so if you guys see there We got some weather that's coming in and It's oof. There's lightning. There's a lot of lightning and here's the thing right so people are gonna start seeing that from the water and Then they're gonna be like oh we got to get back and then they're gonna look at their radars. They're gonna see where it's heading. Oh boy. Oh boy, what do we got here? Uh oh, um, we got some boats coming in, guys. I, I'm they, I mean, they're gonna be coming in hot. I might have to leave a little early because I'm gonna get flooded on. So we'll see, we'll see. Uh, here's what I'll do I'll do something a little different. I'll combine some footage of today, which is the fifth, and a little bit of footage of the fourth, and uh, I'll, I'll mix it into one whole video. So if you guys want to check that out, You'll see a little bit of boats actually leaving. I'll do some little, just just stick around. Just watch this video. Let's see, let's see who's coming in. Somebody, somebody just came in before the storm started to come. So let's see who's who's coming in here. Smaller boat coming in, and uh, we'll see. And it's what's up, guys? All right. Como estaba el día, está bueno. Ah, uh, Alfred. Alfred, all right. All right, guys. So these guys, they they saw it and they're like, "I'm out of here." They see the storm coming. Smaller boats. Here's a little hydro sport coming in too. We'll see. We'll see what we got. Let's see. Oh man, I got the tree of death there. I couldn't cut that dock, that angle, but. Oh boy. Yeah. Did a good job, got it in. This gentleman's coming in. And this guy, you can tell he's a pro. He's not even gonna have a, a pull of faith moment. Oof, this is a lot of lightning, guys. A lot. <sighs> I'm sure the croc will be around now. I'm, I'm starting to figure out that guy's pattern. He goes, he goes to the bottom of the bridge. He hangs out in the bottom of the bridge. He crosses through here, sweeps through the bottom of the fillet table, gets whatever he wants to brunch on, and then hangs out on this corner right over here. And uh, so, you guys ever want to take a swim at black point just do it over there at that dock over there in the corner right next to that sea tow guy look look i'm sure i think i think there might be even a, a video of of a croc on the sea tow boat I, i'm gonna have to look for that don't click away do not hey don't click away listen um look friends I'm here. I'm, I'm, at, I'm at Black Point. I'm at the docks. I'm relaxed. I'm going to edit that back over here. But, but since I came really early in the morning, it's July 4th. So I wanted to go ahead and go right back home, edit this video and show you guys exactly what's going on. Because a lot of boats are leaving. I'm not going to be here to get the boats coming back because I'm going to be doing my own thing. But I did want to show you a little bit this area where the boats are actually coming out of. And then we'll go back to the docks. We'll check out the chit show over there at the docks. But at the same time, I want you guys to see some of the boats that are coming out of this channel because it's amazing, dude. This is this this place is is amazing. Amazingness. Oh my God! Did I tell you it's like 100 degrees outside? Oh wait, wait. Look at that. You, you see that hat? You see that hat? You can't have that hat.
one thing that you guys don't really probably know too much of, right? Look at that. Um, Cuban Americans are very proud uh, Americans. Uh, and a lot of that, sometimes people in other parts of the country won't realize that. They're very, very uh, pro-America and uh, they, um, they take pride in their country, you know? A lot of people are very thankful for the doors that were open for a lot of them. These guys are representing in this Intrepid, gonna have fun with their family, throwing their flags. And it's not about political stuff, guys. I don't try to talk political stuff, but I'm showing you guys what's going on here in Black Point, you know? Um, there's un, not edited, this is, it's kind of like what's going on here. Yeah, a lot of boats coming out, guys. Definitely, the docks are hot, to say the least. But you know, people are just hanging out, man. Going out, making uh, memories, and enjoying the fourth. Um, it kind of sucks that the beaches are closed, you know? Certain people can't go out, you know? Not everybody has a boat to, to be able to go on. They got a long channel. That's what sucks about this uh, marina. The channel is super long. If you guys look over here. Uh-oh. Uh-oh. My feet are going to get wet. No. Anything but this. Yeah. Let's see what we got. Baja's coming back. The Baja's coming back, guys. And it's it's gonna be right next to this one here. Uh-oh. Uh-oh. Is there gonna be a beatdown happening here? No, no, I think the Baja's leaving, guys. There's the Baja. The Baja, I guess, was coming in to pick up his tribe. And uh, they're probably gonna go catch that other power boat that just left right now and race them, who knows. The tree of death is in the way again. So, um, baby fish killer wasn't too happy about my, uh, my digs on uh, my chicho. But we grew up together, bro. We grew up since I was like 10, 12 years old. So me and him go at it all the time. Him and his brother. His brother's also a good friend of mine. What do we got now? The Baja's coming out. Let's go check out this Baja. See, see what we got. We'll see what we got going on here with this little Baja here. What do you guys think? A lot of you guys are in the middle of the country. You'll see a lot of these power boats where you guys are at in your lakes and stuff. We see them over here, but we see them a little bit more up north, like uh, Hallover and all those areas. We don't see them as much over here. Pretty nice though, I ain't gonna lie. All right guys, so here's the, here's the scenario now. I had to move spots. There's a family fishing where I normally film out of, but I guess I don't have the tree of faith here and I can actually get the first few docks 
uh, that I normally don't get. But it's really uncomfortable here, guys. Like, if the croc comes up, I'm done. Like, if he, like, I literally, I'm, t like, now I'm, I'm, like, in the woods. Uh, so you're gonna hear a lot of background uh, noise. Uh, my mic should pick up on on a lot of that. So, whatever it is, what it is. I, I'm trying to get you guys a shot. Everything has been a little crazy. If it's not the the weather, now I got this scenario, and but but we do got some boats coming in. And like I said, I, it's actually a better place to film because you'll be able to see the first two docks. Um, so, should get kind of interesting to say the least. But, Mako that just came into now it's starting people are starting to come back because like I said th there was a problem oh what do we got here what do we got here Ooh. oh boy a lot going on guys a lot going on Oh, somebody's lying. The line, their, their line is stuck on the motor. I think I might have my spot back in a minute. Oh my god, I'm looking away. Oh, the cop can't go because he's getting booby trapped. Oh boy. Oh boy. Welcome to the chit show. I'm gonna have to whisper. Oh God, let me tell you, bro. You can't make you can't make this up, bro. You can't. I mean, I'm telling you, you can't make this stuff up. Yeah, look, look, look at the guy over there in the boat. Like, this is interesting. Um. Oh boy. Well, the, <laughs> the officers can't go to work because there's a there's a line in the way. So this boat's coming out. It looks like he's pretty far in there. Two fifty. Optimax. Welcome to Black Point, bro. <laughs> oh, God. Wait. Oh. We have Aura C. Hold on. Let's go see Aura C. Well, like I said, I, I mean, I, I normally won't be able to get the first dock, so, you know, at the expense of losing my life with the croc, I mean, oh, and uh, the noceums are on roids over here right now. They're on roids. When I tell you, they're bad, bro. Can somebody go to the fish market real quick and bring a couple fish? 
I'm standing on the other side. I just drop it off over there, guys. I need my spot back. Oh my god. Actually, the fishing is terrible right here. If you if you ever come to Black Point, go go to the end and fish fish the end. You'll be able to get some some mangrove snappers and, and uh, you'll catch sharks like you know, you get a, you get you get sharked a lot over there, but you know it's a fight. Snook along the shore, barracudas along the shore. Like when you're walking, you'll see some kudas there. You just gotta know how to catch them. Look at this. This is cool. No excuses, guys. No excuses. You guys ever seen that movie Friday when Devo just comes and just takes everything? I feel like I've just been Devoed. I've been Devoed from my spot. You know, and, and the crazy thing is I was actually here first. But, you know, I went to the car and I didn't want to get wet, so. <laughs> I've been Devoed, bro. No, and now it's kind of weird though because now I'm like actually hidden in the bushes so it's the only spot that I was able to get that's going to give me a clear view of the so they won't see me coming normally when they see me they'll see me at the spot <laughs> but now people are going to be like bro what the hell is this guy doing in the bushes <laughs> god oh my goodness no, I'm telling you you can't make this place up oh look at this I like this little uh, flat bow setup they got going on here Cool. Nice little Optimax Sonic two stroke. The days have been real, real flat, man. Real, real flat. It's got a 115. Thinking that maybe I should just cough like a couple times, you know. I'm downwind. But what's going on here? There's no pull of faith grab or what? They haven't sanitized the pull of faith. Now, now, all that weather is, is on the bay right now. So those people are getting drenched and they're probably waiting for it in a place where they feel safe. I would say a lot of people right now are, are, are at Boca Chita, which is a kind of little island out there that's really pretty uh, in Biscayne Bay. And they're, they're just watching the storm pass. And it took a while. So it should be interesting later how everybody just comes in either soaked um, or terrified. I mean, they won't have a problem in the bay, you know? But outside, even though there's still no wind. So even if you do get caught in a storm right now, it shouldn't be too, too bad. It's hardly any wind. Oh, what the hell is that? What the, what the hell is that? Oh my God. That was the croc or something, dude. Oh my God. 
some something something just completely jumped that has to be the crop doing something i don't know something just happened here this tree is not letting me see but something huge guys when i'm telling you huge um made uh some some fish jump something happened there pretty pretty crazy oh, oh, oh okay i see it now it's a manatee it's a manatee okay makes sense all right makes sense he's behind here i just saw him i saw him in my eyes there he goes there he goes yeah i guess maybe he splashed with his tail he's dump he's dumpster diving some of these people coming in like I said it's kind of different not being able actually being able to to film the other side guys figure out where they're gonna go a lot of flags representing I'm surprised I've yet to see someone bust their ass you know jumping like that from one side of the boat to you would think that they would but I guess not A little Chris Craft coming in. Oh, I think we might have our spot back, guys. Let's see, we'll see. I mean, I know you guys like this perspective, but dude, I'm creeping myself out. Yeah, we got our spot back, so. Oh my goodness, I've never thought, I never thought I'd be so happy to see the pole of, uh, I'm sorry, the tree of death. Oh, uh, it's just bad, guys. Over here, it's like, I got my little, my little scenario back. Let me position my camera. See if we got any heroes. We haven't had a hero. Uh oh. What happened? The engine fell off? Nah, no, that only happens to me, guys. It turned off. But what happened? Let's see. Oh my god, there's a horse fly right now. I'm like, hold on, guys. I'm gonna have to blow this horse fly out of my lens. <laughs> oh, hell no. This guy did not move. I ain't even gonna play. Guys, I'll be right back, bro. I gotta go to Publix and get some wasp killer or something. Bro, look. Look at the size of this guy. Mm -hmm. Hold on a second, guys. Oh, man, I'm trying to get the clip here, but, dude, this thing is making love to, to my camera. What? Get away from me, bro. Mm -hmm. Oh, hell no. Oh, boy. Oh, yeah. This is a disaster. Sorry about that, guys. Get away from me, bro. Look at him. Come, he comes right back. Hell no. Hey, anybody got bug spray? What's going on here? Oh, he's got that pole right there. Oh! See, I, I, oh, oh yeah. Everybody's starting to come in now. Uh oh, we got the Babe Ruth point. We got the Babe Ruth point. Wait, wait, we got a scene at a ramp. 
We got a scene at a ramp. Nope. It's not gonna happen. All right, guys, we're gonna need some uh, jumpers, please. Anybody got a jumper? Uh, qualified, anyone over 300 plus? All right. This is like the first day that I'm gonna actually wish I had some uh, some insect repellent, bro. What the hell's going on here? Oh, look at this big boy. Contender. Contented? I'm confused. Contented. Really? I mean, did your sign guy mess up or? Maybe that's the Cuban version. What's going on over here? I see uh, a lot of commotion. Oh yeah? yeah? A lot of people tell you, hey, you know what? I want you to reach out to me. I got a product called Pad Express. I want to do a demo on your boat. Uh, email me. Look, luxury rib tenders at Gmail. I'll go, I'll take it. Yeah, I'll take it, dude. I'm telling you, it, it'll be, and I want to show it since I've talked about it. It'll look great on that boat. So luxury rib tenders at gmail.com. Yeah, hit me up. I'll definitely. I'll pass by. You, you, you're local. In the area, close by. Dude, hit me up. I'm gonna, I'm gonna show you how cool I play. I'll give you the actual pad. Hey, did you guys get stormed on on the way in? A little bit. A little bit? Yeah, because yeah. we came, I mean, we came from the Keys, though, so. But it, it, did it look bad, the bay? Did it look bad? Because it, it came from here, yeah. That way, yeah, but oh, oh, man, oh, yeah. It wasn't too bad? I thought kind of people were maybe holding off because it looked bad heading that way. I'll be honest with you, bro, I didn't see a lot of people, like, on the bay side. No? I'm, I'm surprised because there's still a bunch of uh, trailers here, yeah. They're, they're somewhere, and, and at some point they gotta go to work. Yeah. Did you guys just hang out or you went to go fish? I got family down there, so. Yeah, sweet. Go yeah, I was fishing in the Keys, man. The fishing is hot right now. It's good. Yeah, it's, dude, it's, dude, we killed it. Everybody's killing it out there right now. Except for me. Ah, don't, <laughs> you're having a good time, bro. <laughs> Take care, man. Thanks, bro, you too. That's crazy. Yeah, the fishing is hot, guys. The mahi are everywhere. Yeah, 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 yeah. You gotta do what you gotta do, bro. Those no CMs are on fire. Que si están picando. Está acabando. Aquí como si tengo cangrejo yo encima. La gente va a decir, el tipo este está quemado. I'm telling them, they're, they're, guys, I'm, guys I'm, the no CMs are hitting me up and I'm telling them, and they're like, they're biting you. I was like, yeah, bro. I'm, they're biting me like if I got crabs. I'm here shaking everywhere, trying to get these things off. It's bad, bro. I know no CMs are on fire. Normally they're not this crazy. A lot of flags coming in for the weekend, you know? Um, Give me a sign, mira. Okay, 
Got this blue water coming out. He's uh, about to leave. He's got two uh, e techs The e techs are gone, guys. They're gone. Look at this contender over there on on the forklift. So pretty. I likes a lot. Me likes a lot. I knew it was going to be busy. Está, está lloviendo allá afuera. Muchísimo. Vino la lluvia todo de repente, ¿verdad? Porque aquí por aquí pasó. Sí, sí, rápido. Sí. All right, guys. Bueno, bueno por, lo, por lo menos aprovecharon el día. All right. Well, I was asking them if they were getting into bad weather, and they said, yeah. So the other guy was coming from the south. These people are probably coming from just the bay, so it's probably a little different. So I don't know. Oh boy, what's going on here? What the hell's here? Oh, we got jumpers. We got jumpers. We got jumpers. We got jumpers. This guy has so much going on. This guy still hasn't found a parking. kill our shot anyways might as well get this nice little dinghy let's see what we got over here what do we got here and it's a caribe oh boy we got we got a whole family of jumpers here There's volunteer jumpers, guys. Oh boy. Oh my God. This is this is when disasters happen, right here. They're sitting. They're standing on the tongue of the trailer. Got it. We're gonna do. We're gonna do something. Wow. There you go. Teamwork makes the dream work. You better bring that motor up. Oof. Just gotta bring that motor up, bro. Sweet. That's a brand new motor. Oh my God. Dude, you're one bump away from just, you know, messing up that skeg. Wow. Crazy, 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 crazy. Oof, you guys saw that lightning? Oh, look at this. Looks like a world cat. 
Oye, te hiciste famoso ese día. No, no, mejor, no me ponga la música, me va a cagar el video. Oye, te voy a llamar para que me haga una paella aquí en el canal. Te voy a llamar. Te voy a llamar. Hazme un favor y choca ahí con contra ahí con, con lo que quiera. Dale, 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 dale sí. <laughs> All right, guys. Ahora, ahora me dice todo el mundo que le diga con lo que estábamos hablando por in en inglés porque no entienden. Todo el mundo. Pero mucha gente. <laughs> All right, guys. So I'm telling him. I'm telling him that. Uh, you guys are going to ask me what we're talking about. And then he just, he used his own version of English. He's actually, uh... So, so he was here one time and, uh, and he was making a scene uh, at, at the dock coming in. And then he tells me he's a local chef that does a, a paella. Paella down here is basically, um, kind of like a, a seafood, you know, with rice and lobster and some people put chicken. It's just a mix of everything. And that's what we call paella. Um, and he's one of the local guys that's well known to, to do them down here. So he'll go to your place and this boat is sweet, man. I really like that boat. So I was telling him, that he became a star. And that's what I was telling him. I go, you became a star. I'm gonna see, I'm gonna see if, if there's a way that I can translate the conversation, see if I can put it, you know, word for word. I, it, it can't be word for word, it's gotta be meaning for meaning. It can't be word for word. If not, it doesn't sound right. So it's gotta be meaning for meaning. He is definitely a character though. He's, he's, he's definitely a, uh, fun dude to be around. You can tell. Last one guys, <laughs> last one before we get out of the rain. We're gonna, we're not gonna get in this rain. And the rain cometh hardcore guys, hardcore, hardcore, hardcore. Let's get out of here. Today's show was brought to you by the following sponsors. Thanks for watching. Don't forget to like and subscribe. And always remember, amazingness, that's what we do.